Tell us a little bit about yourself and the book you're working on. All right, so again, my name is Nick Hart, and I'm going to be working on 50 Interviews Young Entrepreneurs. So basically, I was a young entrepreneur when I was a kid. I always tried to sell things at garage sales and had my own lawnmowing service, and I really wasn't that successful in a lot of things. Um, but then I started reading all these stories, and I'm absolutely fascinated by what young people are doing these days from a business perspective, and I absolutely love the concept of entrepreneurship. So um, number one, I want to get out and talk to 50 of the world's most successful young entrepreneurs and kind of get their story. And then um, also I want to kind of share their stories too. I think they've got a lot of valuable insight as far as what they can uh, provide young people and kind of encourage young people in their own ventures and what they're doing in their lives. And what's the criteria you're using for a young entrepreneur? Originally I wanted to focus more on um, like under 21 years old, mm -hmm. but I've found that there are a lot of really incredible, incredibly successful businesses that are coming out of colleges. And um, so I kind of want to give like a broader range to reach a broader market, but at the same time uh, give people expectations of what they can do. Um, not only just in like middle school, high school, but even in college because uh, I'm a college student right now and I know a lot of people are just going through college, just getting their degrees, going out and partying every weekend. And uh, There's very few people but that really pursue business in college. In college yeah. yeah, exactly. And uh, I think it's, it's something that a lot of people don't even realize they have that option mm. when in college. So. And that's definitely a thread of the successful entrepreneurs. A lot of them started their businesses in college. And these are some of the biggest, most wealthy entrepreneurs I interviewed had started that that entrepreneur bug bit them early. Yeah, and some of the world's biggest corporations were started out of college. I mean, wow. FedEx and Google. I don't know if Google wasn't, but uh, Facebook, obviously. Well, you got the community there, right? Yeah, to connect definitely. with the people. It's a unique opportunity you've got. Yeah. So there's no criteria around like how much money they've made and how much time and age you're not limiting to 21 or under? Yeah, I don't really want to focus on the money as much because I don't think that's the real benefit okay. to being an entrepreneur. I think there's a lot of things that people can learn from their own entrepreneurial experiences and uh, it's I don't think it's necessarily tied to money um, in a lot of ways. So okay. I kind of just find Agreed. the coolest people. Not to what success then? <laughs> what are you looking for? I think... Uh, I guess specifically on the internet, just being able to be a huge influencer, a worldwide influence on the internet is huge. Like there's some kids out there that's 15, 16 years old who have websites that have 50,000 people a month going to them and reading their articles on a daily basis. And um, They might not be making very much money right now, but they've only been doing this uh, for a year or two and down the road they're going to be some of the most successful people on the planet in my opinion. So.